Hey YouTube, what's up? This is going to be a tutorial on how to fix the uh, AMD Gaming Evolved app and not wanting to start. So, um, what happened, what usually happens is you click on the uh, application. Uh, it seems like it's going to start, but it, you don't see the uh, interface on your desktop. So I just clicked on it. It's, it's not there. And you try to click on it again and then you get this error message. Another Raptor desktop app is already running. Please exit. Please exit from the current running error, whatever. So what you need to do is a very simple fix, actually. I um, I discovered it while I was doing something else. It kind of hit me right away. So yeah, you go into uh, your test manager, users, uh, details, sorry, and then R. You press one, um, press R on the keyboard, and then there you go. Those are the um, that's the Raptor application. It seems like it's it says it's running, but the um, interface is not showing up. So what you need to do is very simple. Kill the app. Well, you don't need. It. You don't even need to kill the app. Just leave it on. Very simple fix. Control panel, network, internet, network sharing, adapter settings. I right, gotta close that up. Once you disable the internet, boom. This is a very simple fix. Now you go ahead and re-enable your internet so you'll be able to log on to your account. And there you go. So a couple of things I want to say about this app. The uh, 60 frames uh, per second recordings aren't, aren't as smooth as uh, 60 uh, frames per second recording are supposed to be. It's at 60 frames, but it looks more like a 30 frame uh, 30 frames uh, per second recording. Uh, also, uh, it supports mental, but when you try to record mental, like for instance with Battlefield 4, it cuts down your FPS by uh, at least half. Like if you're doing 90 FPS a second, 90 frames a second, if you start recording mental, you wind up with uh, like 40 uh, frames per second, which is really ridiculous. If it tells you something, it's mental recording is not really optimized for this app. Even though it's an AMD app and stuff, so yeah, uh, um, make sure to uh, leave a comment, subscribe, and, and like the video, share it around, so you know other people would see it, and hopefully AMD would see this shit and figure out a way on how to fix this. Because it seems like it's uh, the app is trying to. Um, when you start the app, it seems like it, the app is trying to connect to a certain server, check for updates, or check for something, and then when you sh shut off the internet, it just suddenly just pops up in your face. It's really, really fucking ridiculous. AMG, you're not doing a good job. You're not doing a good job.